It's uh, set, it's October 21, quarter to seven in the morning. So I'm looking at the uh, rice field, the one that we are experimenting. Here we planted four, four tellers, three to four tellers. And as I walk toward the south, we have increased from four to ten to twenty. And uh, we will then look at uh, how the uh, rice performs. I think this is the uh, dividing line from four to, well, I don't know. So as I work toward here, we would then be increasing the amount of dollars being planted. Here it would be like 10. I believe this is, we planted 20. Now, in, in theory, we, we, would, we should get uh, 80 tellers. If you plant 20 times 4, then it would be 80. However, I don't, I don't think uh, there's a point of inflection where uh, the more you plant, expecting for, uh, 80, for example, uh, there is a, a point of inflection where it doesn't really get up to 80. So I want to know what is that. Uh, for example, this is 10, so it would be 40 tellers. Here would be 80, in theory. I don't think we will get 80. However, it's it's good to know what will transpire. Will we get 80 or close to 80 or 60? I'm not sure. So uh, that's the reason why we need to uh, ex to test, experiment, and then figure out what is the optimum tellers to be planted to get a certain amount. So, uh, it has been, it has, or, it rained last night for uh, several hours. However, it's not enough uh, to flood the rice field. Although it looks flooded, there are parts of the rice field that still need to be flooded. So, uh, we're going to pump out more water today. So, we'll see how this will transpire. It's 4 o'clock. It started to rain uh, from 9 o'clock this morning. So, there's a local uh, storm. The, the wind comes from the east as it rises above the mountain. It precipitates like this. It's, uh, I'm happy that I don't have to pump water. Thanks for watching.